What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'll talk about update 34's combat changes. Now, of course, this update won't be live until June. We'll probably see it here very soon in the public test server. So I'm interested to see some of the PC players go hands on with this. But Zoss gave us kind of a hint of what they're wanting to do yesterday. I will link this article down in the description below. This article, of course, came out yesterday, April the 15th. Like I said, it will be down in the description if you would like to read over it in its entirety. But they kind of talked about two things they're wanting to do when it comes to combat changes within update 34. That's changing some of the morphs in the game and also making some adjustments to champion points. Zoss said they do not really want to go too extreme with the combat changes like they have in the past few updates. So, you know, your update uh, 32s, your update 33s. Well, we had some more extreme changes, especially with update 33, everything kind of going into these hybrid options. They're now wanting to change up within update 34's combat changes. They're wanting to kind of tweak and adjust a lot of the morphs in the game for particular skills. They said they still feel like the meta is shifting and the meta will continue to change as the game goes forward with all the new hybrid options. But they feel like some of the morphs in the game for particular skills are really not on par with the opposite morph. So there's always one clear winner is kind of how they worded it. And they said they did not want there always to be one clear winner when it comes to the morphs. They want both of the morphs to be viable and usable depending on how you are building your character which is going to give us more customization options. And that's kind of what they say. They want players to be able to build the character however they want and have more options. And of course, if both morphs on each individual skill in the game for all the different classes are usable and viable, that is definitely going to be something that uh, will happen. You know, everything that you have uh, kind of to unlock there morph wise, if it is all usable, it's going to definitely open up a lot of different ways to build a character. So they're looking to you know, adjust these morphs. They said you can expect more uh, buffs than nerfs within update 34. I'm sure they're probably going to have to nerf some of the really strong morphs to make them more on par, you know, with this opposite, uh, with the opposite morph that is kind of going against, or, you know, the opposite morph that you have the choice of picking. But it seems like, uh, you know, they're trying to make sure that all morphs are kind of on the same power level. They also talked about some of the changes that coming within uh, update 34 dealing with champion points it says they're wanting to add two more slots to the warfare constellations so they're adjusting some of the values of the more passive nodes in the system that are really pushing some of the more unique options out of the way while giving love to some of the lesser utilized ones as well it says furthermore they're going to add two slotted stars to the sub constellation one focused on helping offensive penetration and a re, uh, re reintroduction of the Exploiter Star from previous iterations of Champion Points. And of course, after that, it said, let there be Lightning Staffs. So it seems like they're going to give us more options for Offensive Pen. And they have been listening to a lot of players saying that Lightning Staffs are nowhere near as useful as they used to be. So they're going to try to do something within that Warfare uh, Constellation or the, you know, the Warfare Tree itself to make you know Lightning Staffs a bit more viable once again. So they're trying to make some small tweaks, it seems, to where everything is going to work really well with the hybrid options we have now because it's the first time we've really had any of these options and as you all know nowadays it's not like a character is a stam sork or a mag sork or a stam templar or a mag templar you're just pretty much you know whatever character you want to be so nowadays you don't say when somebody asks you what's your build you don't say i'm well I'm, i use a mag sork you kind of just say i'm a sork because there's so many different options you have available to you and with these changes to the cp and these changes to uh, what they're looking to do with some of the morphs with certain skills it seems like we're going to have even more options uh, available to us in update 34 when it comes out in june than we do right now with update 33. leave me a comment with your thoughts and of course if you like the video hit the like if you hadn't subscribed yet please do so and i'll catch you next time peace